OK, so in this question, uh, we've got two parts. So A part 1, given that y is equal to log of 2 plus x squared, find dy by dx and show that d2y by dx squared is 4 take away 2x squared over 2 plus x squared squared. OK, so the first thing to do here, y equals log of 2 plus x squared. So to differentiate this, this will become, so we know log of a function differentiates to f prime over f. So we're going to have the derivative of 2 plus x squared in the numerator, which is 2x, and the denominator will have 2 plus x squared. Now, in order to differentiate that, we would use the quotient rule. So we have the bottom, 2 plus x squared times the derivative of the top, take away the top times the derivative of the bottom, all over the bottom squared. So expanding the numerator, we've got 4 plus 2x squared take away 4x squared, all over 2 plus x squared squared. And so we're left with 4 take away 2x squared over 2 plus x squared squared as required. OK, so that is our part one. Now, part two, uh, deduce the Maclaurin series for log of 2 plus x squared and ascending powers of x up to and including the x squared term. OK, so we can use this top row here. OK, so f of x is the log of 2 plus x squared. f prime of x is our 2x over 2 plus x squared. And f double prime of x is the 4 take away 2x squared over 2 plus x squared squared. So we need to find f of 0, f prime of 0, and f double prime of 0. Now f of 0, substituting that in, is just going to be log of 2. f prime of 0, well we're going to get 0 in the numerator, so that's just going to be 0. And f double prime of 0, we're going to get 4 over 2 squared. So 4 over 4 is 1. So therefore, log of 2 plus x squared is equal to, so f of 0 is log 2 plus 0 times x, so plus 0, and then plus 1 over 2 factorial, so 1 half, times x squared. OK, so plus dot, 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 dot. So that is my workings out for part two of A. OK, right, so we've done that. So part B then, by writing 2 plus x squared as two lots of 1 plus a half x squared and using the serious expansion log of 1 plus t equals t take away t squared over 2 plus t squared over 3 take away etc, which is what we've got up here. Uh, verify your result from part A and determine the next non-zero term in the series for log of 2 plus x squared. OK, so it's told us to write that. So the idea here is that we've got log of 2 plus x squared. And I'm going to rewrite that as log of 2 lots of 1 plus a half x squared. That allows me to break the logarithm apart. So we can write it as log of 2 plus log of 1 plus a half x squared. So we can use our log laws in order to do that. So what I can now do is that this is now in the form that I can utilise the series expansion by substituting the t, in this case, for the half of x squared. So this is equal to log 2 plus, so substituting in the t for half x squared, I'm going to get 1 half x squared in there, take away then 1 half x squared over 2 plus, well, 1 half Sorry, that's uh, squared. There is no squared there. And then 1 half x squared cubed over 3, etc. 
okay now we don't really need to go as far as that because it's just saying verify your result from part a and that is result from part a Then we've got this term here, so we've got take away one half squared, so a quarter divided by two is one eighth, so take away one eighth, and that's x squared squared, so x to the four. And so this is the next non-zero term, if I can write down, as required. Okay, I'm not interested in that term. And so that is my answer for part B. Okay, so uh, minus one eighth x to the four is that final, is that next non zero term in the expansion that I wanted to find.